local teen outreach center is celebrating a big victory, getting the help it so desperately needed. Anu Prakash looks at how our story taking action for this group really made a difference. Now more than ever, Doug and Dina Tresino know how much their community cares. We started getting a response right after the story. Uh, we, we got calls that night, uh, people pledging support. That support came after we shared their story about a break-in at Eastside Teen Outreach in East Point. The Tresinos founded the nonprofit back in 2008 to help troubled teens. Nothing was stolen, but the $1,000 in damage to the building threatened to shut them down since it's money they just don't have. We were really afraid that, you know, that expense could really just take us out of business. We shared the story about the break-in and told you about a fundraiser the center was having, and right away the donations started coming in. They raised more than $3,500, which covers more than fixing the damage to the building. That was the biggest expense that we had was securing it with lighting and security systems and surveillance cameras and things like that, which we didn't previously have um, before this happened. Thank you so much to Channel 7 for giving us this opportunity to really share our hearts with the world and the community and what we do. The Tresinos say what happened also stirred up emotions and the teens who come here, they rallied to help too. They really felt violated. They really felt like, you know, hey, somebody came in and they broke my home. We had one teen that gave us a dollar and he said, that's all I have. I wish I had more. And that meant more to me that he gave me his last dollar and I said, no, you don't need to give me the dollar. He said, no, you don't understand. I need to do this for you. And now the teens will even be using the broken glass from the damage to create a sculpture for the center. To them, the glass represents who they are and the, the hope they have for their future. In East Point, a new Prakash, 7 Action News. And the center has received much more even than just money here. But the kind of story you want to hear. Because yeah. of our top story on this, people have been reaching out, offering to volunteer and help the organization. The good coming yes. from bad. How about it? <laughs> Wonderful to see. All right.